it finally happened. I finally found the rest of these stupid figures. Um, <laughs> I'm Alpha Magnus. Uh, these are the highly elusive um, Mass of the Universe Wave 2, I believe. Um, we've got... I've already got the He-Man and that, um, and Skeletor, and I had a Scare Glow, which I got from Big Bad Toy Store. Thank you very much, Big Bad Toy Store, for being awesome. Um, but Manny Faces, Orko, and Trapjaw, I only saw once, and I made the choice. It was the wrong choice, but I bought the uh, the NECA movie Ninja Turtles, and uh, I've seen those a hundred times, never seen these guys again. So, Choices. Here is the barcode if you want to pause and get that because it is specific to this guy. Although Target will tell you that they have them in stock and they don't. These are actually on end caps at Target. Uh, here is the next one for Trapjaw. And here's this one for Orko. Uh, they should all be um, at Target's. Uh, I actually found this one in the electronics department on a sidekick. Uh, very annoying very annoying when they do that because you know where i'm gonna look for toys is somewhere else uh it wasn't even near the uh other stuff it was almost in sporting goods like it was seriously just not anywhere near where it needed to be so we're gonna open these up in the order of my excitement uh least to most so least is trap jaw because i already opened one of these i have trapped jaundice uh up there if you take a look uh this is the regular version that is not the yellow. So that yellow one is going to be turned into something else, most likely, because I have no... I just bought the whole wave. I have no um, inkling to do that. But here is a trap jaw. So... And I also have, like, the Masters of WWE trap jaw, which was, I think, Stone Cold, which I honestly think is kind of a, a lame throw-out character that they did. Um, there's no... Uh, no clips, but they do have these weird rubber band things, which these are actually good if you want to attach stuff to guys on uh, on stuff. He does have uh, the basic articulations of the um, Masters of the Universe classics. You know what? I also have that the re the blue uh, Cronus one too. Like I got so many trap jaws. Trap jaws can believe. I might have to just make an army of them. Um, but here he is standing. He does come with a rubber belt, uh, some paint there, and his weird arm. This is one of the problems that I didn't like, is that this arm is a little different than uh, the other ones. It doesn't have a real pivot, so it just does this. It's a little, little boring. Uh, he does have his little hook on the top, and he comes with a comic toss all this into the garbage. Comes a little comic. I believe all three of them. Yep, they all come with the same comic. So we can take a look here. Got everything. It's in English, so that's nice. So I can read it. Ta-da, ta-da. And there we go. Um new for 20 <laughs> because these are from 2020 so that's funny they didn't even change the comic all right that's fine hopefully they bring out the next wave which is the other wave that i missed out on i think i might have one or two from that wave but man they were real hard to get um these ones uh, and it's funny because i wasn't really hunting them down as much but once you start getting like enough of them you kind of want them all um all right so let's put his gun here the gun is like weirdly like felty rubber uh, but I suppose that makes it easier to, to put in here. And then you also have the ability to put on this claw. But we're just going to plop you right in here. That's lovely. And then right there. And he can hold all of his stuff. Yay! Trap jar. Trap jar. Very cool. Like it. Next up, we've got Manny Faces. Uh, the first time that I've handled this one. I don't know if this is the same as the WWE Eternia one. It's entirely possible that one was a new day so that you can switch the heads. I do also have the... I gotta print out some more stands. I got, like, tons of extra filament I'm gonna do for these stands. What the hell? There. Alright. So... Same comic. 
blah, blah, blah. Here's our accessories. I might be getting interrupted here. Oh, boy. Ugh. You're going to go into the garbage. He does come with his uh, gun, which looks like the only piece that they included from this, which is a little bit bummer. Uh, I thought he had more. Maybe that was just because the 2000X one has a punch. So, it does have a waist swivel, same basic articulation as trap jaw. We do have that. Uh, looks like oh, there is a boot cut. So that's interesting. Uh, this, interestingly, this did not come with the extra piece that tells you what you can remove off the guy, which they must have stopped that because uh, you still can pop them off here. And looks like... Oh, no, yeah, there. So you can pop off the bottom boot, but the top stays still. Um, the A New Day one also had the spinning gimmick. Let's uh, zoom in here since he's a little more interesting than Trappy. Uh, paint's kind of blah on this one. Not going to lie. Um, needed something. But there's many faces in his glory. Uh, the colors do not match between the, the paint and the plastic. Just a little bit bummer. Uh, and he does not come with any extra hands. But I'm sure you could pop those off and trade them if you wanted. His hands are a little different than everybody else's, so I can understand that. I honestly, at this point, just want one of each um, so that I can refill. I can fill out my uh, classics. Or sorry, origins shelf of of these because <sighs> I was a dumbass when I was a, uh, younger, and I sold all of my. Um, Masters Universe, I had them all, and they were all complete, um, but I sold them because they were worth a lot of money. Now they're worth even more money, but uh, they were beat to hell. So my my idea was, I'm going to actually, I'm going to buy all the 2000X ones, because they're way better looking, and they are way better looking, but um, currently Masterverse is filling that line for me, so I'm going to be selling off um, all of my 2000X uh, figures, mostly complete with... Uh, very few of them have broken parts. <laughs> uh, at PowerCon 2023, I'm probably going to get a booth if available. Um, and uh, so these ones are kind of filling that the, the vintage line because they are pretty much just that with more articulation, which is kind of what I liked. Uh, and then these guys are going to do that. Um, there were a couple of them that I sold that I should not have. An Orco was one of them. Uh, my actual He-Man and, and Adam were also in that group. Um, so it's nice to get these guys back. Um, like I'm, I might get, I might get emotional here actually. <laughs> Cause I, I have not had my Orco in, in so long. And the nice part about this one is he does come with a little stand that you can put together like so. He is very, uh, mine's got a little blemish there. That's fine. I, uh, I actually need to buy two of these because I plan on making a mean Jean Okerlund, Okerlund <laughs> uh, out, of, out of an extra one. No biggie there. Uh, hey, same comic, same blah, blah, blah. Whatever. He is one of the ones that you, I don't believe you can take much off. I think maybe his head you can. Uh, if you'd ever want to, I am going to attempt to do that mean Jean. Uh, as I said, but it is not necessary for this. Ta-da! That's about it. So he does have a little different articulation since he doesn't have legs. Um, doesn't look like you can swap it. You might be able to swap the hands out. Uh, but I'm not going to chance it because uh, I don't want to hunt that down again. So Mean Gene Oracle will be, <laughs> will be this. Uh, 
I'm just glad to have them go back. Honestly, this just this just made my week when I found these. Um, found them on Black Friday because you know what the good day to put out things that people are hunting for is on Black Friday when when you just want to casually shop for these. You gotta be a damned psycho. Anyway, here's 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 the wave. Um, as I said, they're currently Target exclusives. You can find them on their website, but they usually say they're out of stock. Um, and they will not say that this is the big thing. If you're looking for these, do not look online because they are listed as online only for, for, for purchase. Uh, but you have to go to the store. That's why I gave you those UPCs. So you could try to get someone from the store to actually look them up. They're going to be like, I need a DCPI, but they can literally just scan the stupid video that I just did and it should work. Uh, those should be big enough and close enough to actually work. So anyway, um, yeah, look, there's mankind. <laughs> uh, check that video out if you if you if you want um and and i will bring this up this is a little little teaser for for a future project i just got it in i'm super stoked about it um and i just saw ramen toy just posted a thing about that they're coming out with one of these but i managed to get myself a uh dolph lundgren head off of aliexpress or ebay i cannot remember uh he does not have the correct hair but i don't care it looks just like it's it's very masterverse, so I'm gonna be excited to put this into my group, with my Frank Franklin Gelator, and then uh, yeah, I have another custom that I'm doing that you guys might might like that uh, has to do with this. No, it is not a Gwildor, but he definitely uh, has touched the cosmic key. So uh, that is gonna be cool. Check out my uh, I might just split the customs channel into another one and then only do toy reviews on this. Uh, who knows? Who knows what I'm doing? I don't know what I'm doing, obviously. Uh, so like, subscribe, comment. Until next time, I'm Alpha Magnus. These are toys. <laughs>